out of nowhere, out of the unknown. Strange in the family, theme music plays, birds chirping, car drives past, birds chirping, honking, traffic humming, boy, go away, go away, leave me alone, go away, go away, will you? Great screech, screeching, crashing, bell ringing, driver, he walked right under me, right under my wheels, he walked, he didn't look, he just walked under the, look, walked under me, groans, wrenches, dog barking, children's voices panting, children laughing, baby crying, train approaching, cuttery, chattering, where do you think you've been? I asked you, where you been? I asked you a question. Wash your hands before supper. How often must I, must you be told never to go out alone? Do you want me, us to be forced to move home again? Do you? I'm talking to you, old Charles. Don't raise your voice. There's no harm done. Let's have supper and forget it. Groans. There's this man following me. What happened? I made him leave me. Well, I think he was killed. Well, how? I didn't mean to hurt him. He walked into the road and Laurie hit, knocked him over. Then it was an accident, yes. Nobody could blame you for that. There's another one of them downstairs. How do you know? Was he with the man who was killed? Did he see what happened? I don't think so. Dollar rings. When I reached the flats, he was waiting on the steps. I suppose we'll have to move again. Oh, God, yes. Bit cheek, really. I wonder if you could spare a drop of milk. Oh, my name is Brown. Just moved in next door. Milk? It's it's too late for the shops. You can get you you can have it back tomorrow. I'll see. Thanks. Oh, it's all right, Dolly. It's this. Uh, it's uh, it's Mister Brown, my wife. How do you do, Missus uh, Wilson? Mister Brown, we'd like to borrow some milk. Certainly, thank you. Sorry to bother you while you're in the middle of supper. We haven't started. Nice flats. What, what aren't they? Nice view. Traffic humming. Balcony everything. I reckon it was dead lucky getting the place next door. I hadn't realised it was empty. Oh, I know a chap who knows a chap who knows a chap. The world gets around in my world of line of business. This looks interesting. A hobby of my son's. Gross fertilisation. Mendelism. Forecast and results. Still at school then? No. I help him occasionally. You're in his li- you're in his li- those line yourself? Yes, a lab assistant in Sepman Modern School Modern School. Boom job. One step above the caretaker. Mm bank is a fine school. A whole future in the hands of the scientists. It beats me how you can bear the responsibility. A boy is following in your footsteps. He sips getting cold. He come when he's hungry. He's not old enough to look after himself. How old is he? Eighteen. Now, is there, gonna, is there anything else you'd like to know? Parentage, politics, blood group, being neighbours. I was interested. In... Sorry, is that enough? Thank you. That's fine. I'll return it tomorrow. Please don't bother. They never stop trying, do they, Evans? Yeah, but this case is going to take a uh, long time. All we have to do is follow it. Exactly, sir. By which time we may have very well be dead. Hole. A stupid accident. Unless, unless, at least, it must have been instantaneous. It would not have happened if he had followed instructions. Oh, yes, sir. Another man was re- ready to take over. Brown and voice controller. Yes, me, looks interesting. Hobby? Charles and voice controller. My son's brown. Gross fertilization. Medalism. Forecast and results. He's still at school then? Charles, no. I hope him, Katie Brown. Do you... Are you in this line of business yourself, Charles? Yes, I'm lab assistant in second monitoring school. Brown, important job, Charles. One step above the caretaker in the round. Every brown, every brown rank is a fine school. How are the plants coming on along, along Charles? Cross, cross fertilization. Do you know? It's something you never thought much about. No joy, it looks as though we're breaking up again. Oh, I suppose you're going We'll be going to the university next night, huh, Charles. Right to Mr. Brown. I never had the chance, much, much more's a pity. You didn't have the brain either, Mr. Brown, chuckles. Oh, yes, yes, quite right. Seriously, though, Charles, why don't you drop in for a chat sometime? 
We were very interested to hear about your experiment. I was discussing it with our, your father the other day. He was telling me, Tuppy, why this experiment, why this experiment again? We threw it all so often. Across the great bean, giant bean with drop bean, result a hybrid. The seeds of hybrid produce one quarter of a drop, one quarter of a pure giant, yet one half hybrid. Evans every time. Waiting for one that's different. That's hardly improbable. Like me, I, I, I happen. Why? Why am I different? I don't know. I'm a mutant. I'm in probability that happened. I want to know how. You have to wait a long time. Your accident at Harvard. How could that have affected me? I know I made mistakes. I try not not to. It's natural for me to make my, use my will. Then we have to move again. So we have to be insulated against the world. Maybe we do, we'll do whatever we do for our, own, it's for our own good. And what about my children? Well, they have to be looked after too. They'll be like me, like me. A sharp cry breaks of the shell. A flowers, I can't talk. I must think. Boy, listen, boy. Outside their swarm, there are only millions. They had to stumble across that something and not use to. They panic, they destroy. Don't want you to be destroyed. This one would be different. How do you know? It feels purple. It's not really purple. But you understand purple better than that. Then a curled spring laughing. Oh, a different word for these, of course. A colour is cool. A flash is a bar waves, brain whistling, train whistling. You must have gone out again. Oh, Charles, I'm frightened. Charles, for him, out of, for him, oh, for him. My son, my darling son, you said you knew him well. Yes, you did. You said, you, you said you got the job. No, well, I always said lies, lies. It doesn't who you know who you are. God, I felt a fool. You obviously didn't get my letter. I wrote to him, you're lying. I'm not lying. Why say I'm pre- to press me? Why say it to press me? You call yourself an agent? I wish I, was, I wish I was your agent. Do the best I can with what you got. You need me no more then. I don't need you to sell myself, thank you. Oh, a postcard in the newsagent window, yes. I am, if I'm a whore, if you, I'm a whore, you're a pimp, a pimp. Shout him. Get your hands off me, hop it. Leave her alone, get back to your ice cream cornet, leave her. Buzz off, go away, look sunny. Do you want your bottom some cracked? Go on away. You're not allowed in here anyway. Go away. Yeah, the air fresh is outside anyway. Thank you. Some same again, please. Church bells three times. Been watching you. Want to talk to you with you. Has he really gone? He had to. You have to wait you have a way with you. What's your name? Paula Wild. An actress. Have you seen me intelligent? No. Pussy fish. Pussy fish with uh, pretty pussies. I have tossed a fish in and pretty pussy. My name is Charles, Charles Whitton. My parents call me Boy. Oh, Boy. Here, yeah, Boy. Good Boy. Perhaps Sonny would fix a commercial. I toss a bone to you. Can we spend an evening together? What? You're joking. You're too young, please. Mm-hmm. Come on. Buy a drink. Sonny's going to be furious. Indecent bar, room chatter. Have a large get gin, please. Oh, half a bottle of bitter, please. Half a bitter uh, for my son, Paula. Mind your head. Head, where are we? Miss Paula Wilde's for penthouse. It's handy. Straight from the cooker to the table. Just straight into from the cooker. If you're in a hurry. The bathroom's over there. The bedroom's through there. But that's not an invitation. Why didn't, why did I bring you back here? Come and have a cup of coffee. Stove like up. May I kiss you? You're very young. You're very pretty. Squeals at hills. Come in. Plot, pots clanging. Watch your hands trembling, grasping your nails. Doesn't matter. Doesn't make any difference. Grasping. I say, let me explain. You can't help the way you're made. You why will you say, stay still? Let me explain. I'm sorry. Please, will you stay still? I don't want you to hurt your feelings. Stay still, boy. Kiss me. See, doesn't make any difference, Paula. You made me. You made me. You made me kiss you. You made me kiss you, Miss Wild. You made me kiss you. Please be quiet. Be quiet. Keep quiet. Muted screams, silence. What on earth is going on down here? What's all, all that noise? What's been happening, Miss Wild? Agonized screams, Charles. 
Stick with your head in the noose for girls like that. I expect a son of mine had more self-control and more sense. I don't know what to say. I hope she's too, not too big to fall to use what she knows. Bring no sugar. Encourage conversation next room. Drink up groans. I don't, can't, I can't help it. Don't say no. Can you pussy? I want him to go. I want to get rid of him. But he said, kiss me. All he said was kiss me. I had to. He could have made me do anything. You warned you about playing with strange boys. I couldn't scream. They turn nasty when they got, got, they change the game. You know what you, what you can do, don't you? They made you leave the pub. That's why you came straight over when I phoned. What do you mean in the pub? He told you to leave. But anyone else had done that. He had kicked off them in the teeth. But you just went. I felt like leaving. I was fed up roaring with him. Sonny, you know what he can do. Do it. I know he can do it. He told me to go and cut my throat. I would have done it. No, he t- could do that. Hypnotism? No. He doesn't. How does he do it, then? How he does is pussy, or you want to take lessons. Give you pussy, you, uh, pussy fish, and he'll sell you them, then, pussy. You write your own c- contracts. Why, if anyone would do, why, if anyone would, could do that? Where does he live? I don't know. Why? I don't know. I don't really believe it. You never know, shuddering. He's not normal. You ought to tell the police. I'm not going to make a fool of myself. So what? What have they got to lose? You will help, won't you? Help? He likes you. Fetch him back. Let him touch me again. He attracted, pulling a present voice. Well, you never know, pussy. That might be something really big. Well, want some? Yes, thanks. I drove away in a car. I lost them. Isn't it? That they will be next time, Pepper. Mm-hmm. She's what he wants. I rather suspect she is, yeah. The, fam- the secret family is scared. But I am, I suppose, he must always be scared of something. Why do they call him Boyo? What is he? Something, something rare and wonderful. At present, we don't know how rare, how wonderful. Remember Hitler? I'm old enough. Every now and then, history throws up a man with unusual powers of persuasion. His count steady willed, steady strong minded man, paved a character rationally. Remember Napoleon? Jonah Ark, I am not that old. Night chuckling. Where's Don Tawanti legend? Bear to influence of a mind, of a mind. May, it must be there in the brain, rather like our powers of reasoning. Imagine the highly developed, with extra sense, then you have him. But there's a great deal more to him than that. The apex of tonsils are two physical organs we don't need but give us a lot of trouble. It's vast areas of the brain, equally outdated, useful, only when we live in caves. However, oh, one of the innovations, I'd say, you born without these defunct handicaps, he's a really wonderfully efficient machine. Tragedy is he's not allowed to be in, in be at the present. So I do to see that he is. My buttons... Getting sore sitting around. My buttons getting sore sitting around. Events may be moving towards some sort of climax. Girls may give us the opportunity. Birds chirping. Boys speaking. Breathe distinctly. Look. I'll show you what else I can do. Right? Cycling excitedly. Tony Simpson, leader of the day's yellow race. He's gone for a 36 to 6 position. Tour from Dax to here. All the way to first stage and the third lap. A tour de France shouting in the background. He now fell out of the race of today because he found he couldn't cycle. And any further, decided so mumbling. He sat on the side of the road, wept while he said, while he said, while he stop it, I don't, stop it, I believe you. Look, I'll show you what else he can do. Shouting in the background continues, just don't say anything. Just say, just think of your name. Don't tell me you think, don't, now don't tell me, just think of your name. Georgia, is that right? Wait a minute. Then was, you know, I think you've stolen name, Clary, is that right? Now listen, I'll tell you what the name is. Don't worry about it. I think you are Alexander, aren't you? Yeah, that's right. Mumbling. 
Now don't tell me what school you go to. Think of, think of it. Burn, burn's head, most ugly modern. That's right, isn't it? Is that right? Your name is John. No. Yes, it is. You're lying. Lying to try and trick me. Name is John, isn't it, children? Yes, and you're his brother, aren't you? Yeah, that's right. I tell you who's your brother. What's your name? Don't t- tell me. Just think. Your original, you. Aren't you? Yes. That's right. Now tell me. Where does your aunt live? Tell me what you want. Your aunt's, what's your aunt's name, Amy? Is that right? Yes, she could be, be one of them, a decoy. Have you thought of down to that? Yes. She wouldn't make me, 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 him leave us. Never thought of that too. Never thought of that too. What happens to him when, for goodness sake, he ends up in prison or operating table? Yes. Oh God, I, I wish he was dead. Charles and uh, said this before. He must go to Australia. We scientists, a trained scientists, be welcome here. We will be the same there. Train rumbles and tracks. Train truckling, chunking. I think you ought to know something. I'm a mutant. Mutant? Well, a mutation means change. A secret. I won't tell anybody. Anyone. Why? Then why tell me? Because I'm different. And you know why I'm, why I'm different. Don't tell me too much. I trust you. Then you shouldn't, Charlie. This is hard, Charles. This is hard world. It's what I've learned. You've well, got to be harder. You've got to grab what's going on, going. Well, at last, there won't be any second chances to learn the hard way. I just believe they, they believe they, they, they own the world. Go on. You understand? No. I, let, I won't let you stop you. You're telling me what about yourself? Give him yes. You see, deaf men grow. Dead men grow in like a railway line, link by link, because the heart holds be steady with, with them until now and then curves, curves out as, as far away again, and stills and rocks and leaves and water, a third kind of music. Will you do something for me? What's the night, man? You meet with me the other night. But you might meet with me the other night. He's my agent. Finds me work. He'd like to meet you again. Well, yes, all right. Yes, well. Perhaps I could do something for you. I'm always on the lookout for fresh talent. That's why I'm here. I've got an office in the West End, actually. Do you see? I believe you. You have something extra. Personally, I felt the, the other night. No half of it, by the way. Drink? You think you might have what I'm looking for? You've got more than that. You're too intelligent for C. You see? You've impressed Paul already. There's his throat. Anyone with a neck like yours could have c- commercials right here, right here. Big money? You know, you don't know. Do you want one big money? Do you, Charlie? It can buy dreams, mind you. Let's talk. Not, let's not talk too fast. I'm only not yet hundred percent convinced you can, in fact, reach the standard I'm looking for. Paula tells me you all got it. Oh, but she's biased. Like a demonstration, no. Make me do something, no. Very well, then. Make me do something I don't want to do, no. Show me, Charlie. It's too dangerous, scoffs. I knew it couldn't. You couldn't miss brain, bird brain here, trying to help another lame duck, dog. So you know he can do it. He doesn't have to prove it again. Pull the whispers, go on. Do it again for me. I ought to knock you sell- your silly head off. Walk. What? Walk in the bedroom. Walk, make me walk. What does that prove? Perhaps I'll make me wash. Climb into the bath. Doesn't prove anything. I, do, I don't mind getting in the bath. Pull the plug around and turn on the taps. Laughter. Hi, you You can't be. Water gushing. Polar shrinks. So he groans. Let's try something else, shall we? This is a little uncomfortable. Lie down, Paula. Oh, no. Why? You can't look. Laughter. Groaning. I'm singing the bath, just singing the bath. Ouch, Paula laughing, slammers. All right, you made your point. That's fine, I believe you can do it, Sonny. Stop it, please, please, I don't want you to stop it. Oh, this is terrible now. Please stop it, leave him, gurgling. Get up, water dripping. Get me a drink. Are you all right? A drink? Damn near drowned me. I knew when I knew when to stop, I didn't. A stupid bath, you murderous bastard, Charlie. You got yourself a contract. I don't want the contract. Yes, you do. Yes, you, you do. You, you do. You're just like you. Just like you, you wanted me. Put on TV. Here's Lester of the Royal Avenue, who's owner, Mister Charles St. George, who's dubious about risking him 
on his, about risking him on his very firm ground, Ascot. But after consultation with trainer Lester, agreed he'd probably be all right. A bit of an age, aren't you? A dangerous sign. I've seen it happen before. If only knew what was happening next door. He's still seeing that girl, lucky boy. She's only she's very attractive. I had to watch her and do nothing. Watch them. Week after week, she advertises on TV, television. Have you seen her? You're trying to pet, get George into the same fitness. Hello? You're making a film today. Yes, she's attractive. Five to one. It makes me f- sick to think. A girl with that creature. Yes, to win. Somebody ought to warn her. Thank you. She knows what she's doing. If her operations goes wrong, she'll have to take the consequences. Just like the rest of us. TV bears the background. It's bendable. Uh, like how? Oh, he's ironed out by a lorry. He made a mistake. Mistakes aren't allowed. A caught in the street unprepared. That was Hal's idea. So easy to pick up with an armed boy. I wasn't, didn't mean that. One shot would be enough. As a potential killer next door, an alien doesn't even need a gun. It's the two green heads with horns. Nobody would think twice about shooting because he looks human. He has to live. We, he has to live. I could put it out of the way myself, like squishing a spider. I thought you last a little longer. I have to take you off the off the case. Don't mean that. I'm tired. Doesn't mean you stay here until I need find a replacement. There will be no violence. That's a no older. I don't mean I was. T- I didn't mean I was tired. And seeing this girl, I can't afford risks. His life is precious. The alien brat's life. No, yours. Evans, Sonny, God, where is he, Paula? He's come. What if he doesn't? He'll come. What if he doesn't? I'm responsible for delivering him to the studio. Boy, he could shoot my reputation to bits. You thought about it? Yes, Locke, mother. Is it late? She's waiting downstairs for me. You realise what will happen if you make this film? Yes, it pay me a lot of money. If you, if for you to, you too. Look, your face is going to become familiar. People are looking, going to recognise you. Will money be so important once you know about you? Paul wants me to make a film. The film where your father talks about the mob. You're not exaggerating. And the mob panics it can destroy. Why else would we keep you away from the world all these years? You must do this, Paula. He's, she's the only one who tries to understand me. She's the only person who treats me like a human being. I'm not going to let you do this to us. We have made too many sacrifices for you already. Open, lock clicks. Open the door. Mother, open the door. Mother, will you unlock the door? I'm late. Mother, lock the door. Unlock the door. I did not come in. He will. Uh, everything's laid on. Car. A transport wrapped in cotton wool. All he has to do is meet us around the corner. Where is he? Perhaps he'd come to his senses. What's bugging you? Him a cheap commercial for cigarettes. Commercials keep you fed. Car horns honking. Drive around the block. There's no point. It's wrong. What's wrong with him? There's something in him. Like electricity. It can't. It could light. It could light up. Light things. Light things life. And what are you using it for? To sell cigarettes. Where there's money in it. Oh, sure. Now, if you could stay. Not. Oh, it's Gabriel. Gabriel. Angel Gabriel. How you go down with the deliverance groans. He's not coming. He's not, he's, uh, they'd go mad at studios. They're no longer looking. Carl beeps outside. Well, just dropped in for a chat. Have to, most visitors will use the front door, but I suppose to annoy you feel I was locked in. I can't run through a chap's living room without a much as, how's your father? At least stop along long enough to have a drink. A friend's waiting downstairs for me. Another day. This won't be another day as far as you're concerned. Been waiting weeks for this. Still better late than never. As they say, I have friends waiting for you and me upstairs. They, mustn't, they don't have to wait as long as they did. I must go. Would you let, make me... You could let me... Make, let me... Let you go. Couldn't you? Could? Why don't you? Make me let you, you go. I'm hungry in a hurry. You couldn't. Be boy like you, please. Make me, make me. There's something heavy in the bill pocket. A gun. Don't let that worry you. A red-headed man with a gun. I'm a traveller, you see. I'm a lot of travelling with valuable samples. A gun comes in handy. 
Oh, what happened to the redhead with a gun? Did he shoot himself? I don't know. A man could be out of his mind to do a thing like that. You don't think yourself... You don't think somebody else took a shot at him? No. He shot himself. Did he now? Why don't you go down... Why didn't you sit down for a minute? I'm late. Take your easy chair. You're going to sit down. You have a gun. They let you in a secret. The gun isn't loaded. Which must have proved to be a good thing. I can't be persuaded to shoot myself. The gun is loaded. you just got to show there's no feeling. There's no feeling. But put it on the mantelpiece, girls. Put something very important to I've got something very important to tell you. Man, life and death. So will you sit down, please? I'm late. Will you please hurry? That's better. I just don't know. You had your hands like that. Didn't you? Nobody told me. Well, well, unusual, unusual. It really does make you different. None of the others had hands like that. And others? Oh, it could be, I'd be, could be shot for letting you out. I reckon you'd like to know. I guess you thought you were the only one. Guns come in handy. And what happened to the red-headed man with a gun? Did he shoot himself? I don't know. Man have to be out of his mind to do a thing like that. Do you think somebody else took a shot at him? No, he shot himself. How did you know? Why don't you sit down for a minute? I'm late. Take that easy chair. Are you going to sit down? You have a gun. Let it go to your secret. The gun is loaded, which might prove to be a good thing. I can't be persuaded to shoot myself. The gun isn't loaded. But you just to show you there's no ill feeling. Put it in on the mantelpiece. Charles, got something very important to tell you. The matter of life and death. So will you sit down, please? I'm late. Will you please hurry? That's better. I don't know. You had hands like that. Did you? Didn't you? No, he told me. Well, well, very unusual. Unusual? I mean, really means it makes you different. None of these others had hands like that. Others? Oh, could be a lot of shot for letting this, that out. But I reckon you're right to know. I guess you thought you were the only one. Your capabilities, I mean, capabilities? Well, let's see, for the sake of argument, that you have capabilities, that others, with your capabilities. They live together in an old castle with lonely stone walls and towers, like a fairy town. Each one thought he's alone, till he brought them together. He brought them together. Now, wouldn't you like to join the others? Them, those others, must be lonely life like on your own. I'm sure you'd be much happier if you joined them. Slipped up on that one. Better put the put it put it better put it with the, it with a gun. Don't put it down. But I must hold it. Don't put it down. You can't put it down. Oh, no, no, don't do it. You see, I was trying to help you. No, don't. Not me. Not with this stuff. No, no. Keep it going. I have to have another look at this. It's the last time I do anything for that sunny chapper. There yeah, you are. You are. They are here, Jim. You better be good off this, Jim. Terry, sorry. I do apologise. Hello. Well, suicide? Uh, any other theory? Swan, the boy, suicide. The boy could be, should be out of the way, agreed, for his own sake. Hence my interest. But putting away, putting, but, but putting away must be legal. Of this, there's no law against being a fool in this country. People can't just disappear, they do. But the other, with the articulate parents behind him. Wilson knows his rights, and I've talked a bid for kid by me. I will write to Hebrew he Scorpius instead, recording. Oh, Mr. Boy and Mr. Brown, Brownie, there's something heavy in your pocket. A gun, Brown? Don't let worry you, Brownie. A red headed man with a gun, Brown. A travel, you see, a lot of traveller. A lot of traveling, valuable samples, guns come in handy. That's why the case takes time. Every step has to be legal. I am not trespassing. I miss my son. I think he may have come here. He may have done. I'd like to have a few words with you. If I may, Dr. Wilson. My name is Evans. Yes, I know. Dr. Evans, a professor of genetics. Yes. Just talk to me. A few moments, the camera will come in. I don't pay any attention to that. Just persuade me, understand persuade. Half of friends around here don't smoke. Make them, right? Let him go then, director. Let's have a rehearsal. I hate waste. That's why I'm anxious that a boy shouldn't be hurt. Pardon me, pardon us. Need a cooperation. 
is our son. He can make take care of him. He can have experience. We're not the only ones, nor is he your son. There's a book, Marcus. He is, there's a book, Marcus, son for Durham, a child four from Northampton. A little girl in Embra. All of them superbly quick, more superbly quick than Charles and others. It's difficult business getting them into my apartment. Complicated matter. Keeping them there, there they are. There, but they're happy because they're allowed to develop freely. Their other parents have had the same, have had it the same, if any, comfort to you. I was with an accident in the research centre a year before your son was born. Nothing to do with child being mutant. How did you find him? Pure chance. Such case, in all such cases, medical port, on the other hand, all the world at the D. In birth, found it way to me. A complete record of your life since then. Why is he, our son, our son malinformed? I beg your pardon. Why is our son, our son malinformed? It must be as something as an elementary, a various theory. Evolution is a gradual process. It takes leaps forward. In his present, present precocious civilization, which he lived this mutation, live investigating is not without interest. When mutants were first persuaded to live together, I noticed a struggle of supremacy over going among them. But the conflict was entirely in the mind. There was no physical struggle. Had we known it, known it if the strongest will was a winner? Ah, of course. Since an order had been established, they settled down contented. Didn't be enough. They are. There it seems to me nature's answer tendency, the human race, to commit suicide. Is it is it, if this um if a new species survives and wars as we know it will not then will end. Of course, be back num back numbers and I But at least you won't be taking the dangers the world being blown up. It'll be a future, new strain, must have every chance. But why I need what that's why I need your son. Will you cooperate? How I need you to persuade him to enter my establishment. He is well be well looked after. A laboratory. Do you want our best we do our best to make them comfortable? Test choose Charles as a person, not a specimen. It's fair and unjust judgment. Contend him to life imprisonment, will you? While well, you have time to experiment on some investiga- new investigation. What kind of parents do you think we are, Dr. Wilson? You're a scientist. You respect facts. You must realise that the only chance for Charles is to be looked after by established authority. You're looking at, like, talking like white paper. There's only one chance for Charles to survive. That's in my laboratory. I want to see what sort of man you make. I want him to live that long, smoke, of oak leaf. A oak leaf is good enough for you. Lights one now. Taste a special oak leaf flavour. Light on light on oak leaf now, 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 laughter. Light on oak leaf now, cheering, overlapping chatter. Pauline, ever in the studio, smoking oak leaf. It's fantastic, Sonny. Enjoy yourself, Paula. How do you do it? Can't, couldn't we take a chance? Still on here. Still here. A roll, Evan said. What can we do? Nothing at the moment. We can only hope. Uh, we can only hope for is to give him a slip. At, all we can hope for is to give him a slip now. At least we have experience and law on our side. Yes. What will the law say about the dead man next door, Charles? You're not going to come in a row now. We're going to do that. What is? We're going to do what I say. We're going to go. We're going to go further away. Try another country. I'm also tried of it all. To open the boy. It is a cess. There's some sandwich in the kitchen. As soon as you've eaten, we're leaving. Leaving? A man next door died this morning. He killed himself. Yes, we believe you. You leave with your mother. I'll stay here to clear things up. When she finds some place where she can lie down, I'll join you abroad. I'm not leaving. What's the best? Uh, so you, so that you do best for you, darling. A man came looking for you today. His name is Evans. He wants to shut you behind stone walls for the rest of your life. I'm not leaving Paula now. She's done enough damage already. She's the only person who might ever made an attempt to understand me. Look, will you can understand. 
These things hurt at a time. At a time, you recover. You understand everything, don't you, Mother? Accept me, please. She understands me. She accepts me, even for my hands. It's not, not something peculiar. Who said you were? To her, I'm not something that's been looked after in the case. Made a mistake. I'm a real person. Toes, you have to help me the bags. Yes, this one. I come to life with her. I'm not leaving. You can throw your life away. Just for the, the sun, well, take the risk, you know, you know, look. You've got to trust us, Charles. I trust you in this morning, Mother. You locked the door. You can't, you won't trust me, but that, trust that girl. Do you know what they meant, they, you mean to her? Uh, you're just here to make money. She builded you into making that film for her boyfriend. She only, he only works on grown up children. He's living with her, sleeps with her. I can, I can call him. Calling things, eating fire, neck pouring, blowing slime, hate, light spitting. Where are you going, light spitting, water rippling? What well, is different about him anyway? Just kid it wears off. I told you, just like being with him. The sweetest way of slowing a chap to the door. Mm. Well, you, well, and well. Wait while well, I put my shirt on, won't you? I'm oh, sorry, Sonny. Sooner or later, we will be back for that old bread and butter. And have your fun. Pardon me while well, I spit into something. Door slams. All right. He's gone. Going. Pick up the kni- knife. What? Pick up the knife. Why? Pick it up. Pick it up. No. I won't hurt you. You mustn't hurt me. You mustn't make, God, mustn't make me, Sonny. Help me. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him, Sonny. What are you doing with that knife? Paolo groans and wrenches. Paolo wrenches violently. Knocking door. Paolo wrenching, sobbing. He know, doesn't know me. My name is Evans. I come to help you. Paolo sobbing, groaning, groaning. Danger, you say? Sobbing, stone walls. They came me together to shut me away. A word for me could avert a prosecution. I must have your cooperation. Get away from me. All of you. Get away. You're quite safe in me. You can trust me. Trust me like men who are crutch, crutches dancing. I can't trust no one. I can't. I call. I have to call an ambulance. All right, back to into colour. Before it snapped, Paul is sorry for loudly. I'm sorry I haven't realised just how, just now how, every side, by, even side by side, there's a universe between us, a crack in the ice, a gap grows wider. I accept that I am. I didn't do it. He made me, he made me. I just be completely what I am. I accept myself as I am. The way I've grown, I'm ready to go now. Paul's sobbing continues. <laughs>